Jackie gonna tell your business. 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 Tell your business. Put your own blast. Tell your business. Don't you tell her ass. Jackie gonna tell your business. Jackie gonna tell your business. Jackie gonna tell your business. Jackie gonna tell your. She gonna tell your business. Girl, I forgot a uh, cartel crew was still coming on. Sorry to that show. I might not watch it anymore. So we open the episode laughing at Simone in this swimsuit, and the joke is on her. <laughs> Ooh, Simone, you messy as shit. <laughs> Sometimes the best way to learn is to get it all out on the table. <laughs> no, girl, you just wanted to take a good chance to get in somebody else's business. Your husband took a chance on business, too. Kids Force. And you lost $25,000 behind it. And I ain't never letting it go. Ever. Not never, ever, ever. Girl, we saw this whole segment last week. Is this last week's episode? I'm getting confused and fuck free. Oh, God. So, Scott start talking about how he was supposedly supporting Contessa and Contessa had to get the hell on. She was like, child, you were whiny and aggravating. Wouldn't let me finish my edge of KK. So, Paulette follows Contessa as she storms off. It's like they have this whole resort to themselves. I don't see anybody. Okay, so Contessa did apparently given up her military career for this fool. And I, I, that really? That cat daddy? Not for some I love. Don't nobody want to see um, back waxing. So Simone gonna throw a little party for Quad. Cecil taking the men to a strip club and uh, daddy gonna get in big trouble with Benya Benya. This episode is drier than Simone's sex life. So Jackie went on and apologized for telling everybody that Buffy, she infertile. Infertile. We don't give a fuck about the ugly husbands going to dinner. Jesus, fast forward. They ain't giving us shit. Girl, if this was a uh, living single, Mariah, you would be a uh, regime. Heavenly tells Quad, you're a lion. To be called a lion by a hippopotamus. A water buffalo, even. Mm, high praise indeed. Ha 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 ha, what? <laughs> what? How do we jump from threesomes to orgies, Contessa? Jesus Christ, Simone, can't you ever just go somewhere and enjoy yourself? Do you always have to play a fucking game? <laughs> Good Lord. Oh my God, it will be the end of the world. I think we should play a game. Why don't you play a game called fucking your husband? Play that. Hey, are we just like making up names? Like we're gonna do uh, fuck, Mary kill just randomly? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, Simone want to hang with Snoop Dogg and get high. Coming up. I, I don't know why people said this was the best episode. Girl, I am not getting anything. We need a bumper. Ooh, oh my God. Where are the asses? They ain't got no asses in Cabo. Ooh. Ooh, Lord. All oh, these... <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No. Oh, these assless dances. Oh, my God. I'm giving you back, 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 back. Oh, my, nothing but back. Oh, ass free. Oh, Lord. Oh, that baby tit. Ciao. Oh, my God. Heavenly said she would shag Terrence Button Penis Howard. Girl. Really? Really? He looked like his breath st Oh, my God. I mean, you are a poor choice, so I'm not surprised you'd make one. Oh, ooh, goodness. I'm sorry. This ain't no kind of cheating, uh, them looking at these little boys on the strip pole. Girl. 
just ass. Oh my God. I mean, just leg to back, leg to back, leg to back. And these pole dancing, this pole dancing isn't that impressive. Girl, they are a part of the rhythmless nation. Oh God. Oh, that sad little twerk. She was trying to get the hip going. Ooh, David got his hand around that stripper. He real comfortable. Okay, now Heavenly says that uh, Common and Quad fuck, but Quad denies it. I don't see Common messing around with a Quad. You don't go to, from Erica Badu and Serena Williams to Quad. Girl, you want a big penis now after you was married to Stuart Little, and I do mean Little all those years? I guess you can switch it up. But let's not act like that was, you know, a standard. So Contessa let Heffley know that the men's was at the strip club. <laughs> Heffley, you had a bitch on your leg. <laughs> she looks truly upset, and I just, I love to see it. Because I can't stand her ass. Daddy ain't here for the attitude. He like, look, you got to play with penises. I can play in a little puss. So Heavenly stormed off, and I just would have been happy. So Heavenly walk into uh, Simone and Jackie's room whining about the fact that her man went to the strip club. Girl, don't nobody care. Grow up. Child, that was one of the sorriest motherfucking episodes I'd have ever seen. We are back to the bullshit. Mm. Girl, David Allen Greer is shooting his shot with Portia. They play the little sad clip. He over here breathing heavy, then grabbed her hand, put it on his knee. <laughs> And quiet as it's kept, I'd rather be with a David Allen Greer than with a Dennis. Actually, that would be fun to be married to him. I feel like you would just be laughing the whole time. Lord, I just don't know who told her to put this dress on. This is too much tit. It really, I mean, it's boom. Boom. I feel like I'm breastfeeding. I need to go get some cookies for all this lactate. So Portia is re-engaged, and they're working on the trust and the relationship. I mean, isn't it just like basically waiting until there's another incident? Like you'll trust it when it's like, okay, we've had 500 days without you slipping into another puss. Seems more like a waiting game to me. You just got to wait and see if he'll fuck up again. Mm -hmm. Ooh, child, they asked, are we getting a reboot of In Living Color? David said, no, next question. I mean, that was with the quickness. That was a, we ain't even going to give you a whisper. Ain't never, ever, ever. Girl, this episode is boring as shit. How can a bumper not bump? Should they play in the game? She trying to explain some shit. Uh, it, 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 it's boring. Almost as boring as Married to Medicine itself. Let me see if I can find a movie trailer or something. Damn. Okay, let me look at this Black Widow trailer. Everybody was talking about that. I never get these superheroes that aren't superheroes, but okay, Heffa. Okay. Couldn't get that girl no powers? Captain Marvel had powers. I want to see that, Heffa. Oh, I can use um, Chris's Disney Plus and finally get to see Captain Marvel. Okay. I might do that for lunch. Because ain't shit on. We're going to get to... Um, uh, ooh, well, actually, shit is on. We've got Sisters. We've got Love and Marriage Huntsville. Wait a minute. Didn't I already do Sisters? That might be last week's Sisters. Yeah, thank God. Okay, that's last week's Sisters. But we've got the Love and Marriage Huntsville Reunion Part 2 too. So I'll get to that and Ready to Love and then... um. Well, after I do Love and Hip Hop. But let's look at this trailer. Okay, so she uh, fighting some heifer that looked just like her. Is this a long lost sister T? I I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. It was a sister T. Okay, so she got to go back to the little CIA training camp or Russian spy training camp, wherever, whatever. And, she, and I guess the sister going with her. Oh, Lord, we got some type of Jack Nicholson rocket man, honey. I don't know who this is, but they could have kept it. He got red and silver on some type of ugly helmet. Mm-mm. I just feel like this would be more interesting if she had powers. Oh, I guess that's the pappy. So it's a superhero family tea, but they ain't superheroes. I'm not a ScarJo fan, 
but that movie didn't seem interesting. Mm. Sorry to that widow. Don't grab my pussy. Don't grab my pussy. I'm your cameraman. I don't want to be anything more to you. I swear. Don't grab my pussy. I'm not attracted to you. You look like Yoda and the Gollum.